Here we're asked to find derivative of three um, trig functions. Let's get started. Secant of x, derivative of this one, you need to rewrite the secant as in d of dx. Secant is 1 over cosine of x. Okay. One way to remember is secant starts with s. 1 over uh, cosine starts with a c. Okay. Derivative of uh, quotient rule says take the top derivative of the first one, which is 0, leave the second one alone, minus 1, leave the first one alone, times the derivative of the first one, divided by bottom squared. Okay, so from here you have sine of x over cosine of x and 1 over cosine of x. This chunk is the secant and this chunk is the tangent of x. Okay, so that's equal to this one. Let's put a check mark on there. Let's do the next one. Derivative of uh, cosecant. Now cosecant starts with uh, c, so you'll have 1 over sine, which is starts with a s. Okay, that's how you're going to remember. Again, take derivative of the first one, which is 0, times the bottom one. We don't really have to write this one, because 0 times this will be 0 anyway. Minus 1 times the derivative of the bottom, which is cosine x over sine squared. Okay, and let's rewrite that, the same thing we did on the first one. And then this is 1 over sine of x. The first part, of course, that's the cotangent x. Now this one starts with, with s, so my second one is going to start with a c. Okay, that's what we had on top. Um, I think I mas missed the minus sign here. Okay, that's the second one. Let's take a look at the last one. d of dx of a cotangent x. This one's a little bit messy, but not too bad. Okay. Let's write a d of dx. Cotangent is the cosine on top and sine on the bottom. And we're going to have to do the um, division, chain, chain rule on the division. Derivative of the first one, which is minus sine x, leave the second one alone on the bottom, minus, leave the first one alone, take derivative of the second one, which is cosine of x divided by sine of x squared. Let's see what we have on top. It's a minus sine squared of x minus cosine squared of x. Okay. So I take minus sine out, I'm actually adding it. Minus sine squared x. Okay. So I have this one equal to uh, minus 1 over sine squared x. So this one is minus CSC x squared. Okay? Have a confident day.